Put all weapons down. If they be clenched fists, release them. Let the blood flow again. If they are sharp, sheathe them. Blunted and heavy, put them down. If your weapon is contained within the ink within your pen, set it down and rethink your motivation for writing. If they be guns, take your finger from the trigger, empty the bullets onto the ground where you stand, put it down and step away. Unstrap the bombs from your heart, go back and question the peaceful God who commands you to do this. Put all weapons down. If you use God as your weapon, whether Christian, Muslim, Hindu or any other, do not speak to them anymore. Or if you speak, do not place your hate upon them and then pretend that it was theirs. Do not search through their books to find weapons. If this is your intention, close the books and put them down. Put all weapons down. If your weapon is placed upon the tip of your tongue, bite it. If it be a stake driven through your heart by a former lover, let it go. To mend your heart in any way, you must put all weapons down. Set them down and step away. Your heart never wanted you to use them anyway. Put all weapons down. Take the rags from the bottlenecks of your Molotov cocktails. Take a drink then put them down. Hand in your riot shields, your truncheons, your gas canisters. Get out of your tanks, land your planes, be they to control the people or of mass destruction. Turn off the electricity in the building that houses the big red button and walk away and let them rust. All your weapons of the state or of the state we're in, put them down, set them down, let them rust. Let them gather the dust that they deserve because we don't need them anymore. Put all weapons down. Put them down. Not even because you will hurt people with them, but because it is hurting you to hold them. Put all weapons down. Put them down. Then walk away.